better lighting I mean it's just this lighting is I don't know it's just it's just off it doesn't look right it looks it looks dead I don't it looks really dead okay so this is part three um to well you know you know what this is this is part three to my sketchbook drawings my sketchbook time this is my time here I need to get some better lighting too because I feel like I hope about uh, daylight uh, bulbs I does that does that mean it, it um, it's more bright it's more white instead of yellow like you know like the left this lamp I have right now it's so yellow and doesn't look very good yeah um if you keep watching I will show you um some of my homemade uh my home some of my homemade some of my homemade recipes I will show you uh, my homemade sketchbook which is sort of like my homemade recipes well of course with these are my recipes because you know I drawn this of course I've drawn all these with a Dixon Ticonderoga by the way so I um, the, um I'm not gonna grab it because I don't feel like pausing it don't feel like oh uh, yeah so this guy um nothing more to say about this guy this guy he's just chilling you know he's just you know having a good day chilling he's chilling out with his buddies <laughs> there there are no buddies i guess he just all by him his lonesome i guess he was such a boring person that no one else wanted to sit with him anymore hmm too bad <laughs> I'm, I'm kidding and uh yeah this guy you know everyone's gonna want to sit with this guy this guy's sort of your sly Nefarious. Or well, not sit with he's standing. Everyone's gonna want to stand with this guy because he does he's your sly nefarious type of type of villain kinda going on. He could be a villain, could not be, I don't know. Little boards in the background there. Yeah, so that's that. And all these they, they seem I've, I've been really crazy about drawing uh, stuffed animals and these, you know, sort of teddy bears is crazy, right? Yeah, so that's that. He, you know, he has whiskers. What's up with that? Does he see that? He he has whiskers. What what's what what is he? Was his mom a rat and his dad was a bear? Hmm. That must have been awkward on the honeymoon. So, um, yeah, so here's, uh, that's that. And then, well, maybe, maybe this is his mom. <laughs> I don't know. So anyway, um, this is, uh, she sort of has whiskers. She's sort of like a squirrel, uh, type of person. I really like the way I drew her because, uh, you know, she sort of has this really nice hourglass type of frame going on. Yeah, it's a little exaggerated because that waist, you know, that waist looks, almost looks like that, uh, that cartoonish type of 22 inch waist type of thing, you know, it looks, you yeah, know, so it's, it's a bit exaggerated, but it's fun. I like that, you know, so yeah, I like the way I drew it, I, I really like, you know, her body, very attractive, I'm, I'm attracted to it, very nice, I like it, and uh, yeah, so I like the legs, I like it, so it's a, it's a good drawing, there's nothing uh, more to say about that, so let's go to the next drawing, I like the drawing though, I think I already said that, yeah, okay, here's the next drawing, uh, this drawing, yeah, I, I don't really know much about it, I don't, I don't know what it means, she, maybe she, it looks like, I know what happened, maybe she was stranded, her clothes, they worn out, they became see-through-ish and very appealing, very appealing to the viewer, I guess. But yeah, you know, that's very, uh, interesting. Anyway, so yeah, I mean, I, I don't really know. It's just, I don't know, I don't know. I, she looked like she'd been crying. It's just, looks like a sad story. So may, maybe, uh, maybe a prince in, uh, in shining armor on his, his white horse will save the day or something like that. It would save her, and they would get married, and it would be just one cliche story that would get bad ratings in the box office. Now, uh, here's another uh, drawing I've drawn. I really like this drawing. This this drawing is uh, I like it a lot. It, it just ha it, it looks. I hope you can understand what I'm saying. I hope I'm not talking too fast. You know, as teenagers, we we talk way too fast. Okay, so this um, you know, um, she just uh, she looks like uh, she's been stranded. Um, on, on this in this cave and and then her savior is going to save her and and they're gonna one off and get married or something like that and, and then that's gonna get more bad ratings in the box office and um but at least it'll make good money though yeah so she's sort of um sort of wearing this interesting type of string type I don't know what you call this it looks interesting though yeah I like the way I drew the figure. It's a very, uh, very dramatic, I'd say dynamic type of pose. I really like this drawing. I was drawing this downstairs. Yeah, so. 
Yeah, I was going just downstairs. Where else do you draw it? Well, usually in the room, I guess. Yeah. This looks like some bona fide American horror story type of action going on here. I don't watch that show because, well, quite frankly, I don't watch anything. But I really wouldn't watch that show because, you know, I want to have an appetite at the end of the day. That show looks creepily horrifying. I don't know. You're not going to eat after watching that. Could you eat while watching The Walking Dead? I don't think so. Um, so, uh, this is that, you know, um, she's sort of, her soul is sort of being sucked away by the devil. Or a demon or whatever. It just looks crazy. Take a, get a look at that. And I like the way I drew the body, though, you know. Um, it's, I like the way I drew that. In this sort of dynamic type of pose, you know. Yeah, so I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, very quick uh, type of drawing here. Of course, again, she's a teddy bear. <laughs> Been drawing way too many teddy bears here. Okay. Um, yeah, so this looks like an angel type of female. Um... Yeah, this looks like an angel, and she's just sort of coming out of this portal. Is that a portal? Let me see, what is that? Yeah, it looks like she's sort of coming out of this sort of uh, rock thing. Looks li like light going on there. I don't know. It's just an interesting. So uh, I like the way um, I like the way uh, the legs came out. I like the way. I, um, one thing I will say is that if I sort of uh, get all critical, uh, this arm, if this arm looks. Uh, fairly, um, fairly skinnier than this arm, so it doesn't really look uh, very symmetrical. But uh, other than that, I like this drawing. It looks, it looks pretty good. I like the wings. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's not talk about that too much. All right. Uh, that's that's it for for today. We're done. Well, no, we're not. We still have to look at the my homemade recipes. Well, no, homemade sketchbook that I did. You know, with some staplers, paper to staple it all together. This is an interesting video. I, I really feel like I'm acting way different. I'm not acting right. Um, I th I'm acting really excited. Okay, so uh, here is this um, uh, drawing. Uh, I've seen this. I've seen her in a in a magazine, and I just drew her. And uh, I, th I think she came out uh, all right. You know, if you study her long enough, there's a couple of things that you know don't look um, very. I don't know, but yeah, this is a really good drawing for me. And for, you know, I, I feel like I accomplished a lot with this drawing. You know, just, just want to just take a look at that again. I don't know what I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say anymore. And uh, she sort of looks kind of like a doll face. She doesn't she doesn't look well. Like you know, I think I think she looks a bit more well, and then you know, she just you know, she doesn't look well. She looks kind of fake. Yeah. So uh, in the last drawing. I, um, is this present. I like the way I did the shading of this bow. I've seen this in the magazine. I see most of this stuff in the magazine, so I just draw this stuff. And, um, yeah, so this looks pretty good. I, uh, I like the way this came out, and, uh, yeah. So I think that's about it. So, and, you know, nothing else more in this. Yeah. So I showed you my homemade recipes, and make sure you subscribe, because that's all I got for you. So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching the Phantom Drawing YouTube channel.